Anderson Cooper 360, weeknights at 8 and 10 on CNN. Usually when someone is arrested, they get Miranda warnings and then they have a choice of whether to answer questions or not. Here, the government has said when there is an imminent danger to public safety, they can question without Miranda warnings. That has traditionally or usually been interpreted to mean a future danger to public safety, the so-called ticking time bomb. Tell us what's going to happen in the future and we're not going to worry about Miranda. What makes this an unusual invocation of the public safety exception is that the government is saying there is no more danger. There is no further conspirator out there. So the government's position may be somewhat internally contradictory. That's something to keep an eye on as this all unfolds. There are many unanswered questions, but that's sort of the broad outline of what the public safety exception means and what the controversy might be. Uh, Mayor Giuliani is a former uh, federal prosecutor. Any thoughts on that? Well, I mean, two thoughts. For, uh, first of all, the, uh, it, it, it could be possible that what they're worried about are not necessarily other co-conspirators, but other conspiracies that he may know about. It may be that there weren't people directly involved in this, but his brother, having spent that much time in Russia, and ha might have imparted to him a lot of information about other things that are going on. So that's a possibility. Secondly, the prosecutor has to decide how important are statements from, uh, from uh, the defendant anyway. Maybe, maybe the prosecutor is pretty comfortable they're going to be able to convict him without uh, having to use his confession, and the intelligence is worth more. So you'd have to know the internals of what they have before you can assess whether this is a sensible invocation or it isn't.